Now, wouldn't it be handy if you could have all the very best AI models all in one place? And that's exactly what this software does for you. In fact, it will choose, as you're having your conversation with it, which AI model is the best for the task that you have given it. So right at the top here, um, you can see this is abacus.ai. There's a link underneath this video if you want to go and check it out. And we'll talk more about how much it costs later, but it's very affordable. You've got root LLM. So here's all the different LLMs. LLMs that it has. So we've got GPT-40, Claude, Llama, Gemini 1.5 Pro. So all of the best ones really. But in total, there's 19 different models that you can choose from. But what I like about this feature, this root LLM is as we're um, putting in a prompt, it will then decide which of those is the best. So I am going to start off by uh, having this create some content for us. And I'm going to ask it to generate an article for us on a specific thing. And then we're going to also use some of its other really powerful features because as I said this is kind of an all-in-one so not only can you create content or do coding but you can also generate images and videos with the very best models like uh, Kling for example and Flux so you've got this all-in-one type thing going on with this so value wise it makes a lot of sense so here we go then let's get started and try this out and see how good it actually is to use can you create a 600 word article about the grand canyon and all of the things that a tourist should go and see and the walks that they should take whilst visiting the site and off it goes so it's now started to um, get going with that it's using GPT-40 mini as the one uh, that it's chosen for writing this so we can see we've got our title introduction um, talking about the key attractions there and it's still going on now the good thing is is that with a uh, Claude with Anthropics Claude if you've ever used that uh, and in fact now more recently with OpenAI's uh, ChatGPT you can use an editor so we can have like the content that, that you're writing over here and then add more instructions to it on the left hand side which is a really nice intuitive way of editing the content and you can do the same with this so you can see we've got our, uh, our article already written up nicely, bulleted out and everything, uh, rafting the uh, Colorado River, helicopter tours, brilliant, uh, no problem with any of that. Now we can go to editor and then we can collaborate uh, on this article. So all I did was just paste the whole article in the box there and then now we've got it in our sort of very traditional left hand side is the instructions and then right hand side is the article itself. And you can go ahead and literally just type in here as well if you want to add in your own content and play around with it you know bold things and and do paragraphs and headings and everything else get it just the way that you want it and when you've done that you're able to just download the article up there so very good for that but what about if we want some really nice images to go with this well that's fine so what we can do is we can just click on image right here and they've got the flux 1.1 pro ultra api linked up so we can create some really good images and i've got a prompt right here that i'm going to use let's try this one out this will be a good photo for this article i feel and we're going to tick this box here that allows uh, uh, the system to modify my prompt to make it even better to get a better result from flux which is ideal and then we want the aspect ratio is 16.9 because i might use this as my blog post header image Click generate and then uh, let it do its magic with flux and we can gradually go through this whole article doing this to create really great piece of content with the beautiful images to go with it as well. So here comes our image. There we go. Look at that. Let's open that up fully. That's brilliant. And my prompt, by the way, in case you wanted to know, was generate an image of a man deep in thought sitting uh, on a on a stone looking out across the Grand Canyon in the United States on a beautiful sunset evening and I think that is a fantastic picture I mean look at the look at the quality of that let's just zoom in a little bit if we can I know I'd have to download it to zoom in but you it is really really high quality we can just press the download button and now we've got that and we can add it to our article but what I'm interested to know in fact if I do download that image if we can now also create a video for it so just by clicking on the more here we've got all of these other different things that we can do we can uh, use us uh, take a screenshot of our computer and then feed that into the uh, prompt area we can create a PowerPoint as well we can analyze videos and I'll show you uh, one of those in a moment we can scrape a whole URL and get all the contents out and do things with that 
But this is the one I want to try now, which is the video generation. So here's the prompt. Um, let's take in the start frame, which I'm going to use as that image that we've just got now. And then um, we'll just say uh, something like this. A man sitting on a rock, looking out on a beautiful sunset evening in the Grand Canyon. And then he stands up turns around and walks away and there we go so we'll do five seconds and then 16.9 aspect ratio again and let's just see uh, how well it does with that so it's done our video now there it is just there i think the best way for me to actually uh, play it is probably just to quickly download the video and then uh, we'll open it up in quick time let's move it over here so you can see it i mean first of all wow look at how real that looks this has been done with cling which is another really top video generator and then i'll press play obviously there's no sound with it or anything like that but let's see what it does wow look at that look how we're kind of going to that edge there and looking over like that and it didn't do what i asked it to do which is to for the guy to get up and walk uh, away maybe i didn't give it enough time because i only generated a five second video but overall i mean the quality of that is is superb i mean look at look at that again look at that it's amazing it looks you know 100 percent legit so uh very very impressive and then you can you know add this to the uh, content if you want to go and create more clips combine them into one and really build up some great content with this product so i really like it again you can go to uh here and you can see all of your previous chats and everything like that and then if we wanted to we could go ahead and turn all of this into like a powerpoint if we wanted to um, uh, or also a document of our choice so we could take this content here and then put it straight into like a word doc or a pdf or something so it's probably very good for creating lead magnets and stuff if you are a marketer something like that one of the other features that's quite handy as well actually is let's say you you know you didn't want to watch a 10 minute video about the grand canyon well you can just go and grab the url like this Go over to your uh, chat and if we want to we can just click uh, just here and then just click uh, scrape or oh, sorry video analysis paste in the YouTube URL and then it will go and have a little look at that for us it's decided to use GPT 4.0 because we've got this root LLM feature and then it's going to analyze the video and give you the lowdown on it in a nice structured simple way that you can read that get all the best from that video very very quickly and easily there you go look at that so fantastic and you could ask it then to uh, turn this into a full blog post for yourself as well what a quick way to create some great content that you know does well uh, already on YouTube so just here the video things to do in Grand Canyon National Park uh, travelers guide 2024 blah 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 below is an analysis and summary of the key points covered in the video and then there it all is talking about activities biking hiking and all of the good stuff that were contained in that video really really good way for you to go and create another video and make sure you've got all the content that youtube clearly thinks is uh, the best for that subject because when i did a search for grand uh, canyon tour guide this video was right here at the top so uh, you can't go wrong with that so i think it's uh, overall very good so now let's just have a little look at what's involved in how much this costs and why you would bother to sign up to this so let's talk about exactly what you get with this abacus ai chat llm teams well for just ten dollars per user per month and the first month is free and then you're signing up you have to pay for two months at once so twenty dollars but you get a lot of value for a start you get about 10 times the message allowance that you would get with any one of these individual llms so if you were signed up with anthropic or you were signed up with chat gpt you get more messages with this plus you have the video generation you have the image generation all of the very best models and of course it gives you the ability to just choose which one of these models you want to use at any one given time so how much does it cost as i said ten dollars very very good value but what about some of the other factors 
Um, is your data protected, for example? Yes, um, they have enterprise compliance, SOC 2, uh, Type 2, and uh, HIPAA, or uh, H-I-P-A-A. So very important standards there as well. And as I say, it is $10 per user per month. So very, very good value. And you can cancel any time you want to as well. So I think it's quite a good thing to have in your AI arsenal, um, this all-in-one system that can just you can jump into, do everything for very, very low price that you want to in terms of content creation, even coding and things like that as well. And then just come out um, and then carry on. So really good value. I encourage you to try it out. And once again, there's a link under this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.